Methinks Kamometai is underestimating the first years. Up for Wedding Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89 and today's Manga Nerdigan Live Reaction video is going to be for Haikyuu chapter 350. So last chapter, um, a very familiar t um, tactic reared its ugly head, which is basically targeting Hinata and trying to get him in a cage and all that shit. But it definitely ain't working right now. It was for a minute, but it ain't working right now. Um, but what they're doing is really interesting because instead of targeting like Nishinoya, for example, um, which was what uh, um, Nakoma did uh, for a minute, um, they're tar targeting Azumin instead. And poor Azumin is just fucking up. Oh, God. But anyway, let's get to this chapter and see what happens next. Gently, lightly, stubbornly, fast, high, strong, and this chapter is titled Freedom and Restraint. And the score's tied at 13, back and forth. Complimenti wants to ride their momentum, but Karasano's first years won't let them. Don't the first years take all the cool parts? It's all good. No helping stuff like that one. Let's just focus on getting the ones we can get. Yeah. Okay, nice kill, nice kill, Izuru. So the score right now is 13, 14, Kamamedai. And um, the rotation right now is uh, Hakuba is serving. Then we got um, Hirogami rotating, rotating with Kanabayashi and Hoshimi in the back. And then in the front, we got Sua, Besho, and Ozawa in the front. And then on our side, we got Tsukushima, which for Dare, I am still waiting, still waiting for the Tsukushima um, uh, Besho roast. I swear, it needs to happen. Seriously, it's driving me nuts that it hasn't happened yet. But anyway, we got Tsukushima, Tanaka, and Kageyama in the front. In the back, we got um, Sawamura, Azumane, and Hinata rotating with uh, Nishinoya. So now it's Hakuba's serve. All right, let's see. Woo, we got it back. Yes, we got our point back. Got it. Um, and now the score is 14-14. That two meter guy looks intimidating, but his serve was pretty normal. Um, it might be that he hasn't really played volleyball that long yet. There aren't a lot of boys volleyball clubs in middle school. Uh, so now we got Kagiyama serving. And then it's Hinata, Hinata rotating with Nishinoya and Azumi in the back. And then Tanaka, Tsukushima, and um, Sawamura in the front. And you motherfuckers at Manga Stream put Azumi twice, which was dumb. No. And the opposite side is basically the same. Um, as it was, like, just a minute ago. Uh, so now it's Kageyama's serve. Keep that crazy serve to yourself. Bring it! Hey, I was wondering, uh, why is it that two-meter guy always off to, um, edge at times like this? Ah, they're keeping him from having, um, to receive the serve. Kageyama's control is crazy, too, so if it was aimed at him, he wouldn't stand a chance. Back attack at Huck uh, by Hakuba, keep him one serve. Yeah, instead I guess he's focusing on a back attack. Ooh. Huh? Ooh, shit, Kageyama. Unlike every other serve he's done uh, so far, this time Kageyama is just aiming to keep it in bounds. There's my baby, Ken. I love you, Ken. That's my baby. Whoa, it's coming to me, but it's not too strong for me to get, get it. Got it. But wait, I should just focus on back attacks and go. Uh oh. Mother in what? God. Seriously, the what? Um, somehow Kamameta was looking. Uh, was caught looking there. Karasano turns the tables, and now we're winning 15-14. God, my bad. That was definitely cows. You said you got it, didn't you? Ugh, he got baited. Kageyama can just baited them into cr getting crossed up there. Most likely, Hakuba Kun was totally focused on attacking there, but then he hesita hesitated because it was a serve he could get. By aiming for the very edge of the court, he was able to perfectly lure Hakuba Kun into trying to receive his serve. A.K.A. Kageyama was trolling motherfuckers. That's what he was doing. Per usual. Uh, Kageyama Tobio is quite the frightening first year. Yeah, don't fuck with the king. Hmm, he's enjoying himself. Huh? Um, Tobio Kanai was thinking he was a hard-headed, serious little goody two-shoes. Um, I don't know Tobio Kan too well, but he probably wouldn't want to hear that coming from you. <laughs> it's, um, a different rotation from before, and he's enjoying himself. And on top of all that, he's trying new things. What's with him being so different from the training camp? Pisses me off. Oh, <laughs> I was thinking 
about food. Strength is being free. Kageyama serve, sec, um, second serve, and God, I have to say this right now. This is real, uh, what Hinata just said here about strength is being free. It really, really makes me think of um, this week's Moonland chapter. It really does because uh, the character Mario um, was saying that uh, you got to have fun while doing gymnastics to basically feel free in the sense. But that's what it's just making me think of. Go, go, go. Come on, Kageyama. You could do it. But I can't believe they thought Kageyama was a goody two shoes. Like, what in what world is Kageyama a goody two shoes? Mm, this. Uh, this time it's an intense fastball. He's controlling the pace at will. Whoa, Hoshimi couldn't do well to get that up in the air. Follow. Nice. Yeah, break free. Break free, motherfuckers. Yeah. Uh oh. No, nice. Oh, it's Tanaka's bro. Azumi son. Oh, shit. Come on, Azumi, don't fuck this up. Oh, shit. Yet again, Kamomedai. Nice block. Um, yet again, Kamomedai shits it down. Damn it, Azumi, you motherfucker. Sorry, it was too low. Don't mind it. No, I thought I could make it. Bye, bad. Um, just now, Kamamei is number one when and intentionally made a gap in the block. Nice kill, nice kill. Yep, let's just get the ones we can get. Um, Aikiji! Scary. Um, this is a huge chance to change the flow. A chance my teammates made for me. I want to decide it here no matter what. I have to finish it. You want to rise to everyone's expectations and read everyone's spirits. The eloquence expressed by his back. Don't crack here, Ace. Oh, man, poor Azumane. Like, I feel like Azumane is going through what Nishinoya went through when um, he was being targeted against um, against Nakoma. And also, um, even, like, the match before that. I just I, I just have this feeling. <laughs> like, I feel like uh, Furudati's doing this um, on purpose because Azumane hasn't really gotten a lot of development um, recently, so it makes sense why Furudati's going this route. Um... But I really enjoyed this chapter. Uh, I love that Kageyama. I love the. I think the best part was the Mia choice were just like. I didn't realize Kageyama was more than just a goody two shoes. <laughs> like, what the fuck? I get it. What world is Kageyama a goody two shoes? I just. I just don't understand it. Anyway, um, what do you guys think of this chapter? I'm very curious what you guys think of what Furudate is doing with, uh, um, with Azumane. I really, really like it. I'm hoping we're going to get, like, some more, um, visual, uh, visual metaphors because, because we haven't really gotten a visual metaphor in a while. And I really feel like with Azumane, he's trying to climb this wall right now. Well, he literally is. <laughs> Let's be real. Um, but I kind of, I'm kind of sad we're not getting any, you know, visual metaphors right now. Because Furudate usually does that, and it's really weird to not see it. Um, I've been seeing more visual metaphors um, and analogies uh, in Hinamaru Zumo more than Haikyuu, which is, which, granted, Kawada does te tend to do that shit, but still. It's just weird that Furudate ain't going this route. It, oh, so much potential wasted. And also, why the fuck are we not getting some Tsukushima roast battling? What the shit is this? I've been waiting for Tsukushima versus Besho. Like, I've been waiting for that shit, and it ain't here. What the fuck? Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys thought of this chapter. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdic and Zink. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive so I can keep bringing you more Haikyuu content, there's a few ways you could do that. You could donate to my PayPal, Patreon, GoFundMe, purchase something off my Amazon wish list, all that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, friend me on um, PlayStation Network, all that's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye!